I'm Barbara. Welcome to the Amoretti Test Kitchen. Today I am making an apple strudel using Amoretti's Apple Pie Artisan. Let's get started. I used Granny Smith apples for this recipe. Peel them, core them, then slice them. If you want to do this ahead of time, you can always put them in a bowl of water with a little bit of lemon and that will keep them from turning brown. Then saute the apples in a little bit of sugar and some cinnamon. It takes about five to eight minutes until they're caramelized. Once that's done, take them out and let them cool. And add the dried fruit with a little bit of butter and just to soften it. Once your apples are cool, you can chop them. Rough chop is fine. Put them in with the dried fruit, saute them together for just a few minutes. Remove it from the heat and add the apple artisan. Stir it in until it's combined. Then roll out your pastry dough. I used a frozen pastry today just because it's easier. So let it sit out for about an hour to an hour and a half to let it defrost. Roll it out and then leave a little area in the middle for the filling and cut slices on the long sides and put the filling in the middle. Then you want to egg wash the strips, fold over the top and then just start braiding all the way down once you come to the end, tuck the ends under and gently lift it onto a sheet pan. Egg wash the top, sprinkle with cinnamon sugar and put it in the oven at 375 for about 35 minutes. Using the apple pie artisan gives an extra different kind of a flavor to the apple strudel. A little bit of an apple pie flavor and I think that this is a great dessert to have at a brunch or in the afternoon. It'd be very good with some ice cream. Who doesn't like ice cream, right? Thanks for joining us today. I hope you enjoyed the video. You know we'd love to hear from you so please leave a comment below or you can reach out to us on Instagram tag at Amoretti or Twitter tag at Amoretti Foods. See you next time.